How's it going, everybody? Welcome back. And today we're going to be talking about shared hosting, what it is and how it can be useful for you. Now, as far as a web hosting provider, I do like to use Hostinger because it offers a lot of features for a very reasonable price. So if you're interested in Hostinger, you'll find links to pricing and discounts in the description down below, which will save you a little bit more money off your first subscription. And you'll find a full review if you'd like to learn more about it. Now, shared hosting is a type of web hosting service in in which a server is shared by multiple websites. Each website on the shared server has its own domain name, but all of the websites share the same server resources, such as CPU, memory, and storage space. Shared hosting is the most affordable and common type of web hosting, making it a popular choice among small businesses, personal websites, and bloggers. It's also a good option for those who are just starting out with their website and expect to have low to moderate traffic. In shared hosting, the hosting provider is responsible for maintaining and updating the server, as well as providing technical support. However, the user is responsible for managing their own website and its content, including the installation of any necessary software, scripts, or plugins. And it comes with a control panel, which allows the user to manage their website, create email accounts and access server logs and other resources. Now, shared hosting plans often come with limitations on the amount of storage, bandwidth and memory that can be used by each website. But it also offers some benefits such as being very cost effective and it's very easy to manage and set up. Now, if you're looking to get yourself a shared hosting plan, I would definitely recommend at least going with the premium web hosting plan. As you can tell, you get 100 websites instead of one, double the amount of storage for not even double the price. You also get free email, unlimited bandwidth and unlimited databases. Of course, you're going to get free SSL and Cloudflare with all of them. Uh, but the cool thing about the premium web hosting is that you also get a domain. Um, although you're not getting daily backups, you still get weekly backups. Uh, but a free domain is definitely a big deal. So I would definitely recommend that. And so unless you already have a domain name that's purchased, um, you can go with the single shared hosting plan, but I still recommend the premium one simply because of the well increased benefits that you get uh, with the premium plan. And if you're expecting more visits or you need more resources, you can always go with the business web hosting as it gives you daily backups, which is a lot of value for the money, considering uh, that you're well paying $3.99 off your first subscription. Of course, the next renewal is going to be charged uh, using the original rate, which is $16.99 for the business web hosting, $10.99 for the premium web hosting, and $9.99 for the single web hosting. So in my opinion, if you want to get a lot of value for your money um, or a big bang for the buck, I would definitely recommend the premium web hosting. So that's pretty much it for this video. If you guys are interested in hosting or you'll find links to pricing discounts in the description down below, which will save you a lot of money off your first term. And you'll find a full review if you'd like to learn a little bit more about hosting or, uh, but of course, all the plans are still covered by 30 day money back guarantee. So in case you're not satisfied with any of these, you can just get yourself the refund before you make the full commitment. Just remember to cancel your subscription and get that refund before the 30th day. And that's pretty much it for this video. Comment below if you have any questions. I'll be happy to answer all of them. Like and subscribe if you'd like to support the channel and stay up to date with everything web hosting. Thank you guys very much for watching and I'll see you in the next one. Have a wonderful day.